Hey guys, before we start today's video, please hit the subscribe button and the bell icon to get instant notifications. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's sketch is of the greatest of superhero as of now in the Marvel Universe that we have seen in movies. So in the comics, uh, we have seen even better, bigger stars uh, until now because it's been long that we are reading comics. But for the movies, uh, as of now, Captain Marvel, we believe she would be the rider of the end game against Thanos. So the movie that was released yesterday on 8th March on the International Women's Day, I felt like sketching Captain Marvel this time. So here I am with my new sketch. This is after a long time. In fact, after my childhood days that I have tried a comic sketch actually. So it took a lot of uh, different times because uh, I made a basic skeleton sketch of this drawing then completely erased it and then made another one because human anatomy as you know because many many of the YouTube artists they are trying and have been successful in this so in this genre I was new so I felt like uh, I should be trying I would love to know how you felt about my sketches uh, before and this one too so what I did was made a pencil sketch at first then used the marker to make the outlines and finally I would be doing the inking. Inking in the sense uh, at first black inks for the dark shaded areas and then colors. The unique thing here is uh, that the colors that I would be using are really very cheap. So. In fact, they are as cheap as uh, it would roughly cost 0 0.21 US dollars. So, yeah, that's what I felt. But uh, I think it came out came out really well as far as uh, the price is concerned. I honestly cannot afford Copics at this moment. So, I had to go on with uh, what I had. So, I would love to know how you felt. I fared here, so that would be nice to, from you guys. So this is the first uh, inking that is uh, of black brush pens. I used two different uh, ones of them. One is this cheap one of Camlin and the other one I have used many other times of Marvies. That one is a bit more pricey than this. I guess many of the artists use Marvi but uh, I do use it in some small sketches, some illustrations, if you have noticed in my Instagram. Meanwhile, I would uh, say that if 
you are on Instagram, then please do visit my page, YT Supart. And uh, I would love the fact if you can follow it. So uh, that will be nice because it helps in encouraging myself to go on with this. And uh, I have been. Maybe have not been as successful, but I guess uh, we can do it together. I can learn from you and you guys can learn from me. So that's how it goes. So in this sketch, uh, I try to show the muscles and the physique. Uh, obviously, in comics, we have known that Captain Marvel has got a real good physique, nice build, a body. And uh, what better than International Women's Day to sketch this, uh, you know, like we can see women on every walk of life to be this brave, this much of a guardian. So Captain Marvel has always been the embody of that because I believe uh, she would be the one who would go ahead and uh, hit Thanos first in the end game. So. Yeah, it feels nice on this uh, remarkable day to sketch this kind of a remarkable character. And uh, I would love to know, as I say always, love to know your thoughts. Please keep commenting on my videos. And uh, I've stopped publishing things on different mediums. I still believe that you guys can find me out from YouTube. So please share it. I would love you all to share this video with your friends because I need that. I need your support. I need your help to grow better. I would need your suggestions like what I should be drawing next and all. That does help. I have not come in front of the camera yet because I feel a bit nervous about that. So as you all know that's some kind of a stage fright. You know, Many of the YouTubers have. They just do voiceovers like me. So that's what it is. Hopefully the inking part went uh, pretty much as I expected that to be. And uh, then finally with the colored brush pens, as I said, very cheap ones. In the Indian national rupee, uh, it cost um, like 350 for 24 sheds. So yeah, it's a bit cheap. Uh, so I use them only. I did not use anything else, any watercolor, nothing, no color pencils also. And that's what for this sketch.
so guys uh, this was a really long uh, video because I thought giving a better tutorial this time would be good because uh, I know I do not publish these kinds of sketches more often but I think people will really be interested in this mostly kids if you're listening then I know that you guys love superheroes even I did and I still do so I do not miss any of the Marvel or DC movies oh, for sure I'm still reading comics so yeah that's why I thought uh, let's make a bigger video of this tutorial and uh, let me know how you felt about this the reds and the orange shades of uh, the mask I, I love them because that's what you know gives that uh, redness that readiness in fact to like overcome any kind of uh, problem in life and that's why I love the colors in this uh, suit the superhero suit that uh, Captain Marvel wears red then blue and the yellow shades in the uniform and that's that's seriously awesome and the white parts that I leave uh, is for you to understand that the light is coming from different directions because if this superhero is flying above you would find light kind coming from straight up so it gets scattered around that's why there's uh, white marks left around the body so that was intentional I must uh, let you know so I think uh, the color the redness of this color was quite bright uh, for the sheep of a marker or a brush pen in fact this is so, and uh, I later on used a bit of orange you would see for this and for blue I just used the normal sky blue because I do not uh, have many options within this 24 shades set hence uh, this was done for the legs uh, the same thing the I think the shoes are red and uh, the leg part is blue so that's what it is uh, other than that the gloves are red along with orange I used the similar kind of a shading technique as I did for the upper part of the suit for hands the right hand and the right leg look smaller because the body is moving upwards from the left end uh, with a fist to be hit so that's everything that we need to uh, keep in mind while sketching any kind of an anatomy so yeah that would be one another point to keep a mark let me know how you felt about this sketch guys thanks for watching this whole video if you're still with me here and uh, thanks for subscribing to my channel and if you have not subscribed yet then please go ahead and subscribe because I need your help I need your support so please subscribe to me please share this video please keep commenting on my videos everything that I said right now would help me would help my channel and that would help me keep making these kinds of videos so Thank you guys thanks for watching i hope to see you in the next video very soon and please follow me on instagram facebook and other social networking sites everything all the details will be provided in the description box below thank you guys thanks for watching bye